Welcome back guys, your boy Scooby Stacks. Continue on with some more Batman Telltale series, episode two, The Pack, part number three. This will be the final video on this episode. I'm not sure how long it's gonna be. Sorry about that, if it's too long. I wanna explain something to you guys. I'm getting comments saying I picked some messed up choices. I know some of you may not like the choices I pick, but I have to pick the choices that I'm picking because I have to gain Harley Quinn trust in her crew. So I will be siding with Harley Quinn all the way. I will be doing a live stream on this Batman Telltale series, a full walkthrough, and I will pick the good choices, the ones you guys want to see. If you guys are new to my channel, smash that like button and hit the subscribe button too. I really appreciate it. So far, I'm loving everything about this episode. It's been amazing. It's keeping it on the heels. You don't know what's going to happen next. Hey guys, if you guys get a chance, check out Fatal Grips for cool gaming stuff. And at the checkout, type in the word Scooby and you'll get 10% off. Their link will be in the description. I want to thank you guys for supporting this series. I could not do it without you guys. Thank you so much. And with that said, let's jump into this and let's do this. Hey now! Welcome to our little hideaway and home away from home. The end of the line. We're happy to have you. Thanks, John. You said you'd kill him after you got what you needed. So what? Ain't a girl allowed to change her mind? Could someone get me out of these handcuffs, please? <laughs> no shit. Tell me why I shouldn't <laughs> kill you. <laughs> well, it seems like the Prince of Gotham is more like an empty suit. I bring us back the transport and the arms we require. You, you bring back a worthless aristocrat. We don't need his money. We have what we need to finish this, thanks to me. He ain't worthless, you overgrown bicep. He already got us an EMP device and the phalanx key. I'll betcha I can find a use for him. I do not care how much these two swoon over you, Wayne. We don't want you here, and we don't need you here. Whoopsie. What the hell? John! <laughs> Turn it off! Turn it off! Now! Can you do something about this? It's freeze. Freeze is coming. Oh, oh shit, freeze. John. Oh shit. <laughs> You need to uncuff me. Don't screw this up. You fool! I can turn it off. Make it stop, or I will seal you both in ice! I swear, if you don't get oh, that electricity... Shit. So we got a match in here. Alright, hit that. Send Make that red. Hell. That's green, that's green. Make this red. Should be good. Oh, we gotta do it again, okay. Red, good. Green. Hold on. Yeah, red's good. Green, green, red, green. There you go. Do it again. How many times do we gotta do it? Red. Red. Make it red again. These two red should be good. Nice. At least we know that it works. I must check on Nora. See how she is. You may have impressed these two, but I haven't made up my mind about crushing your skull. Fair enough. Everyone back to work. There's still a lot to get done. Who put you in charge? Somebody has to give the orders. That was a nice job before. Come on up to my office. Listen, Bruce. I just want to clear the air a little. You showed me you were loyal back at your office. 
did everything I asked, despite all the trouble I gave you. You probably noticed I like to stir things up. It's a bad habit. Well, it's made me more enemies than friends. I want to say, I'm sorry for messing with your people. Your employees. I know they probably mean a lot to you. You were out of line, Harley. You had no right roping them into your games. I said I was sorry, didn't I? I don't blame you for being angry, but I want you to understand. You've seen these animals I work with. In my business, you let your guard down for a second, you get torn to shreds. I can only imagine. If I'm always pushing buttons, it's to keep people off balance, you know? Keep them guessing my next move. Keep the real me hidden. I hope you ain't gonna judge me for it. To be honest, I've been at it so long I don't even notice I'm doing it. It's just a part of who I am. I'll be honest, Harley, I wasn't sure what to make of you. I'm impressed. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. But don't push your luck. You ain't like these others. Bane's a powder keg, Freeze. <laughs> While you saw Freeze, John's sweet. And believe me, he's got heaps of potential. But he's still a growing boy. You though, you got your head screwed on right. You're reasonable. I can work with reasonable. We're pulling a job tonight. I want you to be a part of it. You already showed you know how to use that EMP better than any of these other clowns. I want you to come with. I'm in. Just tell me what to do. That's what I wanted to hear. All will be revealed eventually. Using that EMP though, that's gonna make tonight's job a whole lot less messy. And that no-neck asshat Bane, he loves making a mess. <laughs> People getting killed just makes his day. If you're gonna come with, you gotta convince the others. Convince them? It's a real pain in the ass sometimes, but you need a majority opinion for anything big. And bringing you along, well, you got some persuading to do. Let me know how I can help. So what's the deal with Freeze? He's... unique? You mean why he's blue and wrapped up in machinery? Accident in the lab. Here's the thing about Freeze. Only thing he gives two hoots about is his wife. He gave up everything to try and save her when she got sick. And I mean everything. Job, health, soul, the whole shebang. She's dead? Frozen stiff. Keeps her on ice in the next room while he searches for a cure. Ain't that just kooky? I mean, it explains why he flipped when the EMP went off. But seriously, who does that? I don't know. Sounds pretty romantic to me. Bruce, you big softy. I suppose you could see it that way. It's just made him into such an angry person. You know, it's tearing him up inside. Talking about his wife is the only way to get Freeze to pay attention to you. But watch yourself. His attention ain't always a good thing. I get the feeling Bane doesn't like me very much. That knucklehead respects strength and loyalty. Show him you got those, and he'll come around. He's a man's man. I don't got much time for all that burly machismo, but sit him down for a beer or something. He'll hear what you gotta say. He may kill you when you're done, but at least he'll listen. Come back later, will ya? Spirit of unity? Not really what I'm sensing from this group.
So it looks like they could bench the other crew. Bane and freeze, so it's gonna do that. That's gonna be a job of his own. Mr. Freeze is over here, let's talk to him first. Time to sort through all this. Not with them watching me. I heard about your wife, and I. Oh shit! Hear me out. I might be able to help. What do you mean? You'll answer me if you're smart and understand the concept of self-preservation. What you're doing. Well, that kind of love is rare. My wife followed your goings on in the society columns, Wayne. You are more familiar with lust than love. That's how I know how precious that kind of love is. What if you get caught? Sent to prison? What happens to your wife then? What do you propose? I own technology companies, Victor. Big ones. You could house and protect her. Continue your research to cure her. Why? Why would you do this? Oh, I'm not doing it for nothing. I expect a full return on my investment. <laughs> Practical. I respect that. I'll talk to Bane. Make sure he thinks you're on the level. You have my word. I may have misjudged you. Any tips on handling Bane? I don't know. Go talk to him. Good luck. Yeah, we're gonna need luck talking to Bane. Look at the EMP. What would Harley need with an EMP? I can't risk tampering with it. We already know Bane don't like us. How are we gonna convince him to like us? I don't think it's a good idea messing with someone when they're training. He's ready to fight. Harry doesn't like us. And now I see where Bane gets his fashion sense. Hoping to get another chance to speak with you. Thirsty work. My throat is dry. Fetch Wayne. It sounds to fetch like we're a dog or something. Wow, that's crazy. EMP shielding. This material will keep whatever it's insulating from being affected by the EMP blast. <laughs> what the hell do you want? Bane doesn't want us talking to him. Get out of here. Buddy, it's always so good to see you. Like, so good. Always good to see you, John. I've been wanting to say, Bruce, thanks for helping me out before, and your office, and uh, making me look good. I actually thought you'd be mad about what happened before Wayne Enterprises. You know, Harley really seemed to be... Not at all. Harley and I talked and talked about how lame you are. <laughs> wow. It was by far the longest we've 
ever talked without her losing interest. It was great! I should have known right when we pinky sweared that everything would work out great. Harley wants me to try to get in good with Bane and Freeze. I think you're well on your way to doing just that. And I've been doing, you know, what I can to uh, help, too. You didn't catch it? <laughs> it looked like Bane might kill you. I set off that EMP, you know, as a distraction. Nice one. Thought it might give you a chance to show off your technical skills in front of Freeze. That's the only thing I think he really respects. That was intentional? <laughs> John, how did you manage to do that? No Bane was going to kill you? Seemed like a safe bet. No, no, Lucius would have put safeguards on the EMP to keep you from doing exactly what you did. Then I guess we both got really lucky. And wouldn't you know it, you nailed it. You already know I like you, Bruce. You better get cracking on getting those other guys to like you, too. Because I don't want to have to watch what happens if they don't. Look at this picture up here. Think she really brightens up the room. A thousand watt face. He really loves How'd her. How'd you two meet? Same way you and I met. In Arkham. She found me at a dark time and gave me a reason to live out here and experience all this. I don't see how we aren't destined to be together. <laughs> it just wouldn't make any sense. Wow. <laughs> Did you have one here? Oh, that spot was for Batman. You like Batman. What's not to like? I only saw him for a second in Arkham, but... Oh man, I'd, I'd love to see him again. Prisca. Now, Bane loves that beer. I bought some for when I need to talk to him. He's scarier than anybody in Arkham. So now we gotta go and get Bane his beer. See how he takes this. Hope he doesn't beat us down. Just thought you looked thirsty. <clears throat> Please, come. <laughs> oh shit. Riddler, he bombed your building and killed your friend. Someone did that to me. I'd bomb their building, kill their friend. As Riddler's friend, I have to know, are you here for payback? Did you come for revenge? Answer me, or I will break you in half. The payback I want is with the agency. They wronged me, and now I want to make it right. I'm sure you understand. Riddler studied this Waller woman, profiled her. She is arrogant, presumptuous, and she won't see what we have planned coming. If you want to get back at the Agency, we at least have that in common. In this line of work, one cannot be too careful. Trust has been the hardest thing to find, especially after Riddler's death. I'm not gonna chance it. Yes. 
men you can trust. So hard to find. He was with my crew at the police arsenal. Bane! The prisoner he was supposed to be guarding got away. And yet he doesn't have a scratch on him. This is crazy! I suspect we have a traitor among us. One begins to smell a rat after Riddler's murder and that prisoner getting away. Loyalty is all that we have. But there can be no trust unless I can believe that you are who you say you are and that you are really willing to do all that you claim. Only one of you walks out of here. You know me. The sooner one of you picks up that pipe and bashes the other's head, the sooner we get this over. Fine. I'll prove it. Oh, shit. No, you don't. Hold that. In this. <laughs> oh, shit. What do I do? What do I do? I gotta prove my loyalty. <laughs> we got beans, trust. Very good. Maybe you do have what it takes to join our pack. The package is moving. What's going on? The job we've been getting ready for. It's happening. Good. I'm ready. Not so fast, the money bags. You're not in the pact. Not yet. Not till everyone votes. What do you say, boys? Bruce Wayne. Ian? Or out? The aristocrat is not afraid to dirty his hands. I say we add him to the pact. You got Bane's vote. Nice. There may be more to Wayne than first appeared. You can be trusted. Even. Got his vote Bruce too. Nice, is strong and smart, handsome, like super handsome. It's nuts, you guys. And where was I going with this? Right, right. I vote in. Nice. Well, aren't you, Mr. Popular? Yeah, I am. We got a majority, folks. Bruce is in. You've earned a ticket to ride, pal. Make sure that EMP shield in is on those APCs. I don't need any surprises. Time to get that package. Remember, when we work together, no one can stop us. When we work together, the world yeah, can be yeah, ours! Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go! Somebody grab that thing, it's important. Let's go hit him with the hind! We are close. Make your device ready. Will do. EMP primed and ready to go. Harley. Yeah, what? We have almost reached the target vehicle. Uh -huh. What? No. You uh -huh. are providing our escape. Yeah. Waller. On the move with targets. Track the signal. Get your people here. Now. We've got your signal locked. Cavalry is on the way. Now we do this. Wait, what in the... I gotta say, Bruce, now that we're actually here and it's really happening, I'm feeling some butterflies in my stomach. We have an obstruction ahead, both lanes. Armored vehicles. Service weapons at the ready. Do not engage. It's about to go now, down. Man. Do it! Here we go. What was the hell is going on? HQ, do you copy? My gun, it's fried! All comms are down. Move! Carry the torch, Mr. Suit. 
Deixar! Secure the vehicle! Punch him out. Gotta put him to sleep. Your place is on the perimeter. Keep. Yeah, yeah. Freeze! Open the door! Everyone, stay sharp and keep order. Allow no sudden moves and no talk. Oh, shit. See his eye? Strike it. Go on. Quickly. You're wondering what's in there. Find out for yourself. Right now. There you go. Back off, or I'll shoot. No, no, Just gotta stop no, him. Gotta stop don't. him. Break it off. We don't have time for this. We're not done here, Wayne. I would not turn my back on him. I'll leave this clean up to you, but hurry. Then seize the cargo. Get out of here! Got one guy out there, nice. What the hell is that? Waller, where are you? Oh shit! This freezing plane. Waller here. Let them have it, Wayne. What are you talking about? The package. Let them have it. It's not worth my agent's lives. Waller turned her back on us like we thought she would. You were supposed to be here. And I trusted her. Oh, man. No! Oh, shit. That was my ride! Break out the artillery and disable their vehicles! Ah, oh, shit. No, you don't. Damn it! And fix this all later. For now, just move it. Ball her out. Fix shit later. You just basically abandoned us. I don't wanna hurt ya. But I will blow your heads off if you make me eat concrete. Lights out! Damn! He's a badass, Harley. Oh shit! Put him to the car. Nice. I'm gonna play whack-a-mole with their heads. It's a warrior's death. Oh shit, I gotta pick. What do I do? Bane, Harley, Bane, Harley. Oh, uh, gotta go with Harley. Gotta go with Harley. Harley! Brucey, come join the fun! Keep your arms and legs inside the ride! Look at her. Oh shit! Watch, I gotta protect him. No, you don't. Oh, that was close. I just saved his life. What do you want with us? You're going to sleep. Good night. Sorry about that, but good night. Well, that was fun. Kinda. Be a sweetheart and give me a hand with the luggage. Nice. Damn it, babe! Can you get in the damn car already? Oh shit, he's about to turn. Okay, we'll get you. I'm out of here! Ah oh, shit. We just abandoned Bane, he's gonna piss. Oh, there's a symbol, the Batman call. Can't do two things at once. Ah oh, man, this is crazy. And we just abandoned Bane? That's not gonna go lightly. There's no way Bane's gonna let that ride. He is gonna be pissed. Oh my god. There's gonna be a lot of consequences for that. There's gonna be so much. That's crazy.
Nice work back there, Brucey boy. You really know how to show a girl a good time. Always flirting, Harley. Have your fun now. Oof, the Iceman bummeth. If Bane survives, he'll make us all pay for abandoning him. I agree. Bane will survive. And he won't let this slip. No, he won't. He's probably having a ball. Cracking skulls. We did what we had to do. We retrieved the package, and Harley drove off to make sure we kept it. You tell him. You're all welcome. All right. We got the package. Be grateful you're around to see it. I wonder what's in there. <laughs> Intrigued, Brucey? Wanna know what's inside? Yeah, I do. Go on. Open it. Oh shit, Riddler. Whew! I thought he stank when he was alive. You really put us through a lot of trouble, Mr. Smarty Pants. Getting yourself killed like that. We needed you for the next stage. I've got what you need. For the right price. What the fuck? Not who I think it is. Catwoman it is. Oh shit. Catwoman's gonna be hooking up with Harley and them. This is gonna be a crazy episode three is gonna be it. Nuts. 99.7 of the players, so we did good there with Waller. We got 100% right there with Gordon. We always have Gordon's bag. 35.4 players left Alfred feeling stressed. Sorry, Alfred. Didn't mean to have the percentage so low, man, but some of the choices is hard, man. 50.7 players left Harley feeling happy. Yeah, we three were her all the way. We had our, everything she did, we had our back. We had to convince her that we was on her side and her crew, so we was all the way for Harley. 23.2 players left Tiffany feeling freaked out. Yeah, we didn't do a lot of stuff to make her with a high percentage. We went kind of against her because the whole time we was kind of convinced Harley and her crew. So Tiffany wasn't really feeling too safe and she wanted to know about her dad's death, so... I knew that percentage was going to be low. 50.7 players left John feeling happy. That's good. We basically did everything that John Doe wanted us to do. So he was on our side the whole time. So we, we got his trust. We knew we had his trust. So did you get Tiffany to hand over the key? 43.9 and 56.1. That was a tough choice. It was kind of hard to get her to hand it over because she didn't want to hand it over because I was with them peoples. So that was really, really hard. 34.7 players, did you call Gordon or Waller? I went with Waller, but should have called Gordon, but I was trying to get Waller on my side. But it seemed like that backfired at the end because he abandoned me anyway. I should have just called Gordon. Did you pay off Willie or let you resolve with violence? We took him out, man. We wanted to show that John Doe that we was willing to knock him out. We had his back. And who did you leave behind right here? 46% or 54? I had to go with Harley. I was on Harley's side. I didn't want to leave Bane behind, man. But Bane is going to definitely make, make us pay for that. And did you pinky square? We got that. 95.4 for 4.6%. We did really good there. Friends for life, John. Friends for life. So my percentages were kind of low on this. Except for the one. That's because I was on Harley and Bane's side on the crew. Like I told you guys before in the beginning of the intro, I will be doing a live stream with this. So on the live stream, I will pick everything that you guys want to see. My percentages should be a lot better on that. So far, I like this episode. This episode is best. I still think season two is way better than season one already. And it's only two episodes. We still got three episodes left. I liked everything about it. Leave your opinion. Tell me what you guys thought. Leave in the comments. So that's it for this video. 
Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.